How are we doing out there? First thing first, my name is Kenneth Berg. I'm the creator of Luminous 4K Screen Paint using ambient light rejection technology, gain times two. Uh, now, we've been talking about quite a bit about our short throw and ultra short throw screen paint. Uh, it is available now on our website. We sold quite a bit of it uh, around one o'clock this morning. Uh, so this is the new screen paint that will allow you to be able to turn just about any surface you want into either a front and rear, depending on what kind of surface you use. If you decide to use a form of a transparent, not transparent, but yeah, you can get a transparent uh, surface. This is actually made out of the same material that your grandmother may have on her furniture to protect it. So this is a plastic I got at a fabric store for around probably about uh, 20 bucks. All right, so um, keep in mind, like I said, if you coat it on this, you get a front and rear projection screen. Uh, if you decide that you want to paint it onto your wall, it's just going to be front projection only. So over here, I'm using the projector I got off eBay. Uh, just to let you know, I did contact the seller. This is the last one he has. He said he may be getting more in, so when he does, I'll post that information up front so you can get a chance to get the projector if he does have them uh, in stock or if you can get more of them. So this is my NEC. Uh, this projector right here is, I think it's the um, the U310W uh, Ultra Short Throw Projector, 3100 lumens. We're doing this in 720p, and this is on a screen that I designed using some very thin vinyl and coating it with our new screen paint. And keep in mind, this is the um, I think we're actually be shorting the name a bit. This is our Illuminous Ambient Light Rejection ultra short throw uh, 4k screen paint and keep in mind if you're using this uh, with a projector of an ultra uh, sorry ultra or short throw projector you can use it with 720p uh, 1080p and also too with 4k this one's actually 720p all right so we'll start the demonstration right now now keep in mind this is a spray on application and we have it available now on the website and one quart and two i'm uh, sorry one quart and one gallon all right so let's begin Of course, we got to add more light in the environment. So I need my overhead lights. Now keep in mind, I've done this demonstration also to on long throw, but I wanted to wait until I got the short throw in so I can show you exactly how the screen is going to react with an ultra short throw projector. See how much light is hitting the screen. The screen's not going to wash out, it's not going to fade. Now for a screen this light, it has amazing contrast capability. Okay, so let's grab ourselves another video. Oh yeah, I've got another one playing right now. Forgot to set it up for more than one video. And as I said, this is gonna be a spray on application only. My projector's only 720p. So instead of you going out and spending all this money for a ultra short throw screen, you can actually make your own. Now keep in mind you can actually coat this, it doesn't have to be vinyl, it doesn't have to be plexiglass. You can coat this onto your pre-existing projection screen, you can coat this onto your fixed frame screens. You can paint it directly on your wall if you want to.
right, the spring takes in. Now that's why we did this demonstration first on the long throw, the 4K long throw, because I wanted to show you that um, even at a distance for a screen that was designed for short throw, it's still going to pick up at eight, between eight and seven feet from the screen. Now right here in the living room, with all the lights on, there is my 178 inch 235.1. That right there is the cinema paint on my short throw projector. Fully lit environment. That's just how these screens are designed to react. how beautiful the color is. Like I said, for a screen this light that can pick up contrast and good color level, actually fantastic color level. It looks fantastic and this is only 720p. I know some of you out there are going to be using laser projectors on the screen. Designed to take in a lot of light. Look at that. Screen is, this is my screen right there. Condensed lighting hit in the screen. Window open. Plenty of light in the environment. All right. Hope you enjoyed the video demonstration. I am Kenneth from Illuminous 4K Screen Paint. Our new ambient light rejection, ultra short throw and short throw screen paint is available now on our website. It does come with free worldwide shipping. I love the fact this technology pulls up with the lights on, no problem. Lights off, doesn't make a difference. All right, gotta go. Hope you enjoyed the video demonstration. Thank you all for your time. Let me show you the screen right here, the 235.1. This right here is 178 inches. Like right next to an open window, condensed lighting with contact with the screen. This is what I'm talking about. My, actually, my, um, 4K projector sits there, which I gotta put right back up there. A 4K projector sits 14 feet and eight inches from the screen. And that's what we pull up. If you notice, I don't have to set the scenery for my screens. I don't have to sit there and uh, put certain lights peppered out through the environment. I don't have to have my um, screen submerged in dark environments. This is the everyday setting I have on my screen every day. I'm going to have my windows open. I've done, this, I've done this a thousand times in all my demonstrations. And like I said, when you go up there, you're not going to find a lot of people doing demonstrations like us. They can't. Doors open. This is my screen right there, fully lit environment. Done this on short though, done this on long throw. This is 720p also. You see I got direct light hitting the screen. Over here, all the lights are on. The screen looks absolutely fantastic.
That's the one thing about our technology, man. You got people out there that constantly will try to tear down what we do over here, and it's because it's a jealous thing. Because they can't figure out how to make anything better, so they just want to tear us down. And that doesn't bother us. We just let them sit in the corner and make fools of themselves. And it just shows what kind of people they actually are. So I just sit here and just design my tech. Do it in a fully lit environment as always. Use long throws, short throws. We do demonstrations that other people don't do. You look at my demonstrations and what other people are doing, they don't do the same things we do. They shy away from the light. They don't use high-end um, um, samples. The tester screens against the low caliber projectors. We freeze our screens, literally freeze screens to show exactly how these screens don't crack or peel. Now, just want to add something really quick, and I'm sorry I have to add this into the video. We got a certain individual who has a constant habit, we all know who he is, of basically trying to slander our technology. And I find it quite a um, bit of a, uh, a bit hilarious that in one of his videos he claimed that, oh, he's walking away from Crystal Edge and he's not going to do any more um, um, slandering demonstrations, which he went right back to that. So, interesting, we could order your product right now and we could test it and our element and I'm thinking about doing that pretty soon all right hope you enjoyed the video demonstration I'd like to thank you all for your time uh, the new screen paint is available we have to consider the, oh, sorry screen screen is available on our website you have to consider the fact that when you develop good technology you're always going to have individuals out there trying to tear you down we don't paint any mind but like I said um, I may decide to put his technology out there um, and under our our environment all right, again, hope you enjoyed the video demonstration. Again, I'm Kenneth Bird. Thank you all for your time and God bless.